to start day one of the Keep It Simple series. Today is chest and triceps, so you're gonna need some weights. I have 15s, 10s, and 5s. If you don't have a big selection, use what you have. After today, after today you'll know what you really need to do this class on your own. So unlike most workouts you see from me, this one is not driven by the music. Usually we are always going to the beat. The music pulls our workout right through to the end. This can be done without music. All the reps don't have to go to the music. It is quick, it is straight to the point. This is your strength training program for a four day workout plan. So it's not a long workout. It's to show you, you can get this in during your week, a very straightforward program that you can take yourself and do it again. Let's start with a march. Deep breath in, raise it up. Shake it down this time. Into a little twist. Let's wake up that low back. Reach across. Reaching up. Big stretch through each side. Big shoulder roll up and around. Give me a step tap and a shoulder roll. Push it to the front. Now let's step it back just for fun. Keep pushing forward. Elbows in a little closer. Plant the feet and swim. Reverse. Let's press it out to the side. Push, push. Overhead, take it up. arms up, bend it back. Tip at the hips, elbows up. Swing them back. Standing back up, let's rotate up, down. Hold them up, take it front and back. Little wider stance twist, two and two.
Hands on your head. Take it side, center. Four more. Four, three, two, one. Nice job, big shoulder roll. So first up, we're gonna go down on our back on the mat. We have an A press to start. So pretend I'm lying on the floor right now. This is what your arms are gonna look like. Palms facing each other, like you could clap your hands, holding the dumbbells. Elbows come down and up. Notice my elbows are a lot lower than my shoulders. This, one, this is what it looks like from the mat. Here, and squeeze up. Squeezing the chest on your way up, breathing out. Ready, we're gonna do 10 of those. Breathing out each time, 10. Feel free to take it at your own pace. We have little breaks in between sets, you'll be able to catch up. Or maybe you're going faster, maybe slow it down a little bit, really squeeze. Nice controlled movements. Last one for me. And we're taking about 30 second breaks in between. So this workout is all about keeping it simple. It doesn't have to be a big production in your day. You can either get it done before your day starts, or maybe you're gonna do little bits throughout the day to finish it. 30 seconds. Were those dumbbells heavy enough? If they weren't, either get heavier ones right now or do a few more reps. Going for the 10 again. Ready? A press, let's go. Breathing out on the way up. I have three left, where are you at? Finish them strong, those last couple reps should be getting heavy. If they're not heavy yet, do a couple extra right here. Thirty seconds rest, approximately. We have one more set with those A presses. Last set, try to stick with the heavier ones. You can always switch halfway through. Ready, here we go. Squeeze that chest. Big breath out every time you lift them. I'm halfway there right now. So your last set should be the most challenging. You should feel like, oh, I don't know if I'm gonna make it with this set of dumbbells. I might have to go lighter, but you're gonna try to push through. Nice job. If it wasn't heavy enough, keep going for a couple. We're switching exercises now. Flies are up next. While you're taking a break, I'm gonna show you what those are. So pretend I'm lying on the mat. Hands are still facing each other. We're gonna take them out wide. Like you're giving someone a giant hug. Ooh. Watch my wrists. They're gonna stay nice and strong. The whole arm is rounded just slightly. A little bend in that elbow. The wrists are not flopping to the side with the weight. Let's give that a try on the floor. So these ones might have to go a little bit lighter. Starting your hands up at the top. Let's give it a try for 10. Slowly out, slowly up. 
So if anything's going to touch the floor right now, it would be my elbows. I'm halfway there, focusing on my breathing, focusing on that squeeze through the chest. Last two right here. And a little break. If it wasn't heavy enough, keep going right now. Two more, just like that. Could you have gone heavier? If you can, let's go right now. You can always switch them. This is your workout. Give me 10, here we go. I have two more. Oh, that last one was rough. We have one more set just like that. Take a little break. Now, I don't know if you noticed, but when I do that first set of an exercise, I'm usually choosing my middle pair, my tens because let's say my warm up wasn't as effective as I wanted it to be, I'm not actually warm enough to do these exercises. To be safe, I start out a little bit lighter, feels good, I feel strong, then I move to my heavier set for the second round. Third round should still be your heavy set, maybe heavier if you can, you can always drop down in between. Third set, coming up, let's try to stay strong with it. Ready? Here we go. Slowly out, slowly up. Slow, controlled. I'm halfway there, five to go. Last one. There it is. Nice job. Third chest exercise coming up. Give your arms a little rest. So this next one is a chest press. I'll show you what that's gonna look like. Remember your push-up position. Elbows are a little lower than the shoulders, as in closer to your feet. So picture this lying on your back. So it's like you can give your feet a high five. Let's set it up. So I'm feeling very warm. I can start with those heavy ones now. See how it feels. I can always switch it up. Nice strong wrists. Elbows lower than your shoulders. Ready? Let's squeeze up and down 10. Breathe out on your way up. Half 
halfway there. Last one for me. And a little break here, nice job. You can take a little drink in between, whatever you need. Second set coming right up. All right, setting up. Slow, controlled, breathe out on the way up, let's go. We have five more. Last one coming right up. Ooh, break. One more set, then we're done with chest. Take a minute. Not literally a minute. You could. <laughs> Let's set it up. Ready, strong last round, here we go. Breathing out. Squeeze through the, through the chest. If they're not heavy enough, I want you to pretend they are. Really squeeze, focus, nice controlled movement. Four to go for me. They should be getting really heavy right now. Two left. There it is. Nice job. So we're moving on to two tricep exercises. More than halfway through your workout. Straightforward, easy way to get in your strength training. All right, first up for triceps, we have some skull crushers. They sound worse than they are. Have a look at the setup. Laying back, you can either put two dumbbells together, have them come towards the forehead, and back up. Or, you can hold on to each end of a dumbbell towards the forehead and back up to straight arms. Let's give this a try. Ready. Give me 10, nice and slow. Here we go. I'm breathing out as I extend those arms up to straight. Halfway there. Last one. Nice work. Little break in between. You don't necessarily have to sit up. Just Hang out, 
Give yourself a moment. Maybe you're upping your weight for the second set. So we did three exercises for chest. We're doing two exercises for tricep. The bigger muscle gets a little bit more, smaller muscle a little bit less. Let's replay that. 10 more, round two. Here we go. I'm sticking with my 10s for this one. I might try those 15s for the last round. I think ideally this would be a 12 pound situation. Halfway there. Last one. Beautiful. We have one more just like that. I'm gonna up my weight, see how it goes. You might see me drop back down. Little break, breathing. And we only have one exercise after this one to go. Just like that, easy peasy, keeping it simple today. Ready, last set of 10. Keep it strong, everybody. Breathing out as you lift those arms to straight. A lot of shaking going on. I have three left. Last one. Ooh, nice job. All right, next one, your last exercise, we're gonna be standing up. Take a second, grab a drink. could be one dumbbell or two. I'll show you with one first. Holding it by both ends. Taking it overhead. Your arms are going to stay close to your ears. It's going to go back and up. A few things you need to watch for. Elbows are not coming to the sides and up. They're hugging in close to your head as best you can. We're going to kick one foot back. Most of the weight being in that front leg. So this isn't an excuse to lean back more. This is to prevent you from leaning back. Stay up nice and tall. You could also take the two dumbbells and put them together, just like we did in the Skull Crushers. Ready? One leg back, arms in as tight as you can keep them. Slowly down, slowly up. I'm gonna cross these, they're a little bit slippery. Get a good grip. Breathing out as you come up. Halfway there. Two more. Nice job. I'm going to go for one dumbbell for the next time. A little 15 action. Take that break. Breathe. Two sets left, then we're doing a little stretch and you're done. Ready. Here we go. 
Keep that core strong. Don't lean back. Halfway there. Two more. Oh, nice job. We have one more set. We're gonna try to stick with this 15. We'll see how it goes. Deep breaths. Mental prep for that last set. It's gonna be a good one. Ready? Set it up. Halfway there. Last two. And one. Nice job, that's it. Stretching it out, cooling it down. Let's start by sweeping the arms over, under, over, under. Palms facing each other, really opening up through the chest. So that is your no cardio. Keep it simple series, all strength training, easy to do on your own. You can take that format. Maybe you wanna do some body weight exercises, some dumbbell exercises, that's up to you. Now let's sweep the arms down and up. Just a little bend in the knees here. Hold them up this time. Let's take one elbow back, pushing it down, breathing. Changing sides. Now, hopefully you're close to a wall or something you can hold on to. You're gonna put your palm on the wall Put your armpit towards the wall and then you're going to peel that outside shoulder back. Feeling that stretch through the chest. Try to have that hand up around shoulder height. Same stretch but place that arm a little bit higher on the wall. Trying to not knock over my sign there. Still pushing my armpit into the wall, peeling that other shoulder back. Nice deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth. Let it go, let's change arms. Straight across, somewhere around shoulder height. Push your arm into the wall, peel the outside shoulder back, and breathe.
Take that arm up high, push your shoulder back in. Peel the other shoulder away. Let it go. We're gonna clap, don't trip on your water bottle. We're gonna either place the palms on the low back or clasp the hands behind. Open up through the chest, looking up, peeling those shoulders back and down. Nice deep breaths here. Let it go, let's sweep it low. Sweep it up, give yourselves a hand. Awesome job, everybody. So that's day one of the Keep It Simple series.